Hey YouTubers, it's Brent from Extended Play Arcade. Got a great pickup today. Pretty pumped. As you can see, it's from Digital Press Video Games in Clifton, New Jersey. Love that place. I saw on the computer the other day that they had this in and I had to go grab it. I've been waiting for one, but right, I'm going to open the uh, what I got in the bag first. For, I got uh, the 99, it was buy two, get one free. I didn't have this one. It's Madden 96. I know right now everybody's thinking, oh no, more sports games. I'm out of here. I'm, I'm signing off. I'm, don't worry. Stick around. It's cool. So just picked up that one because it's 99 cents, dude. I mean, seriously, I wanted to big up, um, build up my Genesis collection because I've been having a lot of friends come over and play, which is actually a lot of fun. So I like the sports games too because a lot of people played them. So I'm sorry. Not, a, not everybody played all the crazy um, RPGs. Not that I'm the hating, but I'm just saying. All right, this one I picked up for 99 cents. Had a little bit of label damage. I'm not even quite sure. Let me take a look. Yep, I already had it. I wasn't sure if I had it, but for 99 cents, you know what? Maybe I'll kind of fix it up or whatever and do a giveaway or something. I'm not quite sure. Um, but hey, 99 cents, you can't beat that. I needed one extra. I, I had a feeling I had this one. Unfortunately, I do. So, but hey. Again, that one was the free one then. Uh, and I picked up, I do not know if I have this for the Atari 2600 Maze Craze. I'm going to have to go through my, had a little bit of label, but not really in good shape. It's untested. Uh, again, you buy two, get one free. So for $2, I got all these. You know, most say it's crap, but you know what? I'm a collector. I want to have these. I love them. That's what I do. So let's see what else I got here. I got one game. <sighs> I've been eyeing them. It sounds like I'm out of breath a little bit. But I'm just pretty excited. I had one game that I wanted a while. Uh, they actually look like they lowered the price on it. Because I usually see this thing in the $10 range. And I just was like, ah, I can't have it for $10. But I got it for $6.99. It is Commando. This is one of my favorite games uh, on the NES as a kid. I played the snot out of it. I love throwing the grenade over the bridge. That one part where the tank, uh, the, the little jeep, and you throw on the grenades over the bridge. That's one of my. It's one of my fondest memories uh, playing the NES. So I'm going to definitely be playing this. Uh, Six ninety nine. Great price for Commando, in my opinion. And the last but not least, which is probably going to give away this. So maybe. You know what? It's sports, TV, hockey. You guys all know I've been pick, trying to pick up every hockey game ever made, to an extent. Um, me and my buddies used to play this. We had the multi-tap, which I'm going to try to pick up. We had four controllers going at once and four players playing on the same team. I mean, it was awesome. We were calling for the puck. I wish it had like a stick tap, so you said, you know, tap the stick, pass it over to me. But uh, this is, uh, you know, these... Obviously, you know, let me just wait. I got a Turbo Graphics 16. I know I ruined the surprise with this one, but I've been wanting to get this game for quite a while. Turbo Graphics is hard to find. I think I paid a little bit more than I wanted to uh, in the long run, but it's just, I've just been watching the prices. They're just going up and up and up. Or uh, So when I bought the system, I got it for 149. It's got a 30 day warranty. Uh, comes with one game, which I think this game's like a ten dollar game. I don't know off the top of my head. Um, it's only it's only got the uh, cart, but still. Um, so technically, I got this for one thirty nine. <laughs> so it comes with one controller. I, t uh, I didn't test out the store, but it seems pretty tight. And I got the system. No major dam. There's no damage at all, actually. Um, no scratches. No nothing. It's pretty clean. Looks like it was in a good house. Uh, usually, a lot of the times when I see these things on Evil Bay. Uh, eBay, I meant. Um, <laughs> they are really dusty. They've been sitting in somebody's uh, cardboard bin in their in their attic for a while. So I got the power control and the RF cable, which I'm gonna hook this thing up. Maybe I'll kind of do a video on how to hook it up. And uh, I don't think I need to do a review because there's probably like 900 of these on. So you got your little locking thing, hook up your pin, and everything. So I'm pretty pumped. I finally pull, bought the billet. Uh, uh, bought, bought the bullet, but bit the bullet, bit the bullet, that's it, and got myself Turbo Graphics 16. So uh, I'm gonna, I'm st still working on. I'm gonna I'll pan to the to the right here a little bit, if you bear with me. I've been working on cleaning. There's the 
the closet right there. It's got all the games in there, door can close. I'm going to have a, a mystery like shelf door, hidden door right here. Right now it's like an office and I'll uh, have my editing room in there. All my games, I moved. Uh, it's kind of a mess right now. I have a broken Corona sign, unfortunately. I tripped and knocked a, my hockey stick into it and it smashed it. So I don't think I can fix that. And uh, my color balance is a little off because it's color balance. And for these white lights, I get all my NES. I got my antenna, Nintendo Entertainment System. What I'm gonna do is kind of clean all this up a little bit at the bottom. Um, you can see, you, you guys saw it, and I got my X arcades, the original ones at the bottom. They don't even have that trackball uh, for sale anymore. I don't think it's a hidden gem or, or anything, but it was actually worked really well. And uh, that's it. So uh, let me spin back around. I'm actually going to paint this, that area, this color. So I'm not, I'm not doing anything crazy. So anyway, guys, quick wrap up. Got the three games for two bucks. I got Commando, which I've been wanting for quite a while, which is awesome. And uh, I got this, got my TurboGrafx-16, so I can't wait to play it. I never owned one as a kid. Uh, my friend had one. I had the Genesis. We kind of made a deal. He Obviously, the Genesis became like my favorite uh, system of all time. Um, but this TurboGrafx, man, that is one ex expensive system to, uh, I mean, even just the sports games. Or, or, or ten dollars i saw a tennis game was fourteen dollars so i don't know how i'm going to pull the uh, collecting off for this it's going to be few and far between maybe i'll uh try some emulated games first just to see which ones i like and which ones i don't like before i spend the thirty dollars per game uh on average so anyway guys brent from extended play arcade make sure you like subscribe comment um tell me what you like tell me what you don't like um actually keep the don't like to yourself i don't care <laughs> just kidding have a good one guys peace